YouTube, what's going on as you guys know I am True Truist, today I got something absolutely fascinating for everyone that plays Minecraft, I actually am on the early access beta for the Minecraft 1.13 snapshot, and there's a lot of different little secrets I need to tell you guys, because these things will actually blow your mind, there's some really crazy things you guys can actually do with them, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are going to find these to be absolutely awesome so anyways so before you to the video make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like on the video is it possible could we get potentially 802 likes 802 802 likes if that's possible that would be so awesome also too if you guys want to actually be added into my minecraft pocket edition realm comment below your gamer tag i'm only going to be adding people that actually stay to the end of the video because i'll have some secret words along the way of this video so make sure you guys stay tuned for these secret words if of course i do actually say a secret word and you guys leave your gamer tag with that secret word you guys actually have an awesome chance of getting added into my minecraft pocket edition realm so anyways so let's get into today's video so based on this box right here you guys can clearly see this is something you probably have never seen in minecraft before you can actually make like full globes in minecraft now which is insane how do you actually do this well there's actually a brand new method in minecraft where you can actually place item frames on the floor as well as the ceiling so say for example if i make just a very simple type of like house or something um we'll, we'll make a we'll make a pretty big house here we'll, we'll get a nice little like roof going here and then um if we actually just make a wall and we extend the wall you can now put item frames on the top uh, ceiling of the wall so now you can put them on either like above it or if you have a block you can actually put the item frame right on top of it and you can make an awesome little 3d looking like globe if you really wanted to at all angles i mean that's really one of the cool things you can actually do with that also you can do what i did here and made this awesome like 3d looking like earth room if you would say that's really cool you guys can actually do that so clearly with the item frames that are actually able to actually go on the floor there's a lot of things you can actually do that make it look really cool if you guys want to need some like cool like flooring obviously you can actually do that now which is awesome however though there's some little things that you guys need to know so first things first you guys can see if I have like a tripwire hook and you try putting a item frame on top of it it won't actually go on top of it even if you like put one on the side and try to stack it somehow it still won't actually work so if you guys want to do something very interesting and very cool and very useful what you can actually do is you can delete the like actually you wouldn't be using string anyways but you can actually use the new item frames with redstone so if you actually go ahead and if you get an item frame and you actually put the item frame on like not the actual hit detection on the actual like redstone but uh, right next to it you can see it's a little bit bigger you can actually go ahead and place that down there so you can almost hide your redstone with that so that's pretty cool so i mean if you want to just go ahead and you know you probably stack up some maps somehow maybe and even be a little bit more stealthy somehow i don't know you can do something kind of weird with that if you really wanted to which is kind of interesting so like extra extra secretive redstone and which is really cool and even though i can still use it if i actually put a redstone um like torch right here and then i'll go extend it just to show you guys it actually is still working you guys can see it is starting up right here, it's glowing, you can see it's glowing through the actual maps and the item frame itself, and it's still registering on the other side too. So you can actually have a super secretive looking redstone contraption if you really want to, using the brand new Minecraft 1.13 update, which is pretty cool. So we have that out of the way, maybe item frames out of the way, you can make some cool looking globe things, you can make some very secretive looking maps, if you would say the least, um, but there's actually some more things you can actually do one of them is actually a debug stick they actually gave us this very magical looking stick to say the least it looks enchanted obviously because it can do some pretty crazy things if you guys want to actually get the actual um, debug stick you want to go ahead and just do the normal like give command and you can actually do like p or at true trees and then you can do minecraft and then we'll do debug underscore stick and then the count we'll just do we'll just do two 
we'll give, we'll give us two of them. So now we have some more of them. Obviously, I have them in my inventory here, but of course, I already had one in my hand. These things are actually really, really cool. It kind of reminds me of Bone Meal, to say the least, where if an actual, like, um, like I guess a block has a property, you can actually walk up to the block itself and change it, which is really cool. You can see, like, obviously the sunflowers, they come in, like, two different, like, forms. It is, like, a half or, like, a upper half, I would say, like, half lower, half upper, which is pretty cool. You can also do some really crazy things, too, if I actually get a fence here. Let me quick go grab something. So, I actually have a cobblestone wall here, and you can make some, like, weird, interesting-looking things, of course. There's actually a unique pattern. I can go in more in depth in another video, but you can actually make, like, an invisible barrier block, if you would say, where it's an actual invisible block where people actually won't be able to actually go through and uh, go through it. But anyway, what you can actually do now is you can actually get the debug stick and you can actually change the stick so it's actually up and selected and you can make the block invisible which is really really crazy so it's not invisible i mean it's invisible and the player can walk through it but if you actually align those blocks in a certain way mobs won't be able to actually go through either which is insane so with the debug stick and the item frames which is really really awesome there's even some more brand new features that a lot of you guys are going to absolutely adore and love so anyways what is that feature well you can actually teleport not only from like a certain position or location you guys know the coordinates of course but what we can actually do is something very very awesome and very unique and what you can actually do is you can say if you want to just teleport 10 blocks in front of you you can actually do that now so if I actually do like the normal teleport command and we'll do true triz just like this um you can actually do like the actual little care top things two three and then we'll do like 15 there we go and i think i didn't mess up the command here hang on one second so i think i just do tp and then we just do the carrot top carrot top carrot top and then we'll do like 10 12 15 i don't know we'll, we'll, we'll try there we go okay so i just went ahead and just teleported just like that um normally you would have to use like teleportation you do like tp and then you do these little like squigglies the tilde i believe they're called and then you would actually do that so i mean but now you can actually do that with the actual um like teleportation little carrot tops too so obviously it will take some time i guess to get used to i of course am still trying to get used to that whole new teleportation command which is pretty cool i'm hoping that they will in fact add that to the minecraft pocket edition version which would be pretty awesome if you guys ask me so anyways though like i said before i'm really hyped like i said if you guys are sticking around till the end of the video i do appreciate you guys so much and i'm going to give you guys a secret word the secret word is going to be redstone so comment below in the comment section redstone with your gamer tag so i know you guys stuck around to this point of the video i do appreciate you guys that actually did so and i'll add a few of you guys to my realm but anyways let's continue this awesome video so with all the brand new features i just showed you guys what is your favorite new little secret feature there's some more other features i do want to talk to you guys about including some very secretive information that I'm sure a lot of you guys are really going to enjoy. So there's still going to be apparently some more uh, like snapshots later this week. I will be giving you guys all the videos and I keep getting you guys informed of course if you guys are interested in that. I'm really really stoked for more Minecraft content coming your way. If you guys are pumped, you guys are ready for the holidays, let me know in the comment section and uh, I'm looking forward to having an awesome awesome rest of the month of December with you guys but anyways my name is true Triz. have an absolutely awesome epic day and remember guys stay true peace